Oh, hey guys. He's so... Oh, it's me, obviously. He, but what we are doing is... We are... Well, doing a couple clothespin hacks. It's, and I just finished making a Kinder Egg uh, bomb. Um, a Kinder Egg pod bomb. Um, and uh, go check that video out. The only thing I forgot to mention in that video was today was the first day of grade 8. Or well, not 8, grade 9. And it was actually pretty good. I liked it. But, sorry, I just had everything set up. But what you do for this is you take an old deodorant or hairspray or anything like that at, uh, at cap and you just put glue on it hot glue it's, uh, doesn't have to be hot glue just any quick drying glue and then you t uh, take apart clothespins and put them on and then I just put rubber bands in all the little divots and then and I'll tell you what you could do with the springs in a second but then you take uh, off an old sharpener or pencil sharpener, you take the blade and you hot glue it to one of the flat sides of a clothespin after you take it apart and you hot glue the other one on. I put hot glue on the outside just to, just in case and it's actually pretty good, just gotta find the blade. There it is. But yeah, it cut right through. Where is it? Over right there. Okay, yeah, I cut right through with a minimum uh, amount of pressure. And then I have another match gun, but it's like, but it's not using clothespins. And then I have another one using just the spring, but it's too complex to just tell you how to build it. My matches are right here. I'm just gonna grab one. Okay, but for this one, all you need to do to load it, I find this one's the easiest. So first what you gotta do is you gotta take apart a clothespin and, and then you gotta dig out a little divot right there. I find it easier to put a really small drill bit and then just turn on the drill and then you just carve a little divot like that and, and then and cut one right at, like, right at this divot, right at this little divot right here. Or just cut it and then uh, put a rubber band on here and don't glue it because you need to slide it up and then to load it you just slide it up, click that in pull it back and then it drops down and then pick this end up oh, like I am here, stick the end of the match in just the tip just like that and then fire it actually shoots pretty good, it bounced back and hit me he, so oh, and this one and uh, you just take apart two clothespins, and uh, you don't need the spring. And the, with the first one, you just need one piece. And you just take a, a thick rubber band, put it around, and then rubber band it to the other sides. And if it has slack, put it around. And then uh, with this part that's on this side, not the smooth side, uh, wrap it around these. Wrap a rubber band around here. And then take the smooth one, and it just locks right in here easily. Uh, just, just pick it up out of there, put it at the back of the match, and then pull it back, and fire! That one doesn't shoot as good, but hey, it still shoots. It's, it actually went into the banana, I had to pull the match out of the banana. And then with the springs, things, I just got two here, her, her butt, and I'll tell you why. Hey, but you just want to take one end of one spring, stick it in there, and then in there, her, her, and then if it gets stuck like that, just push it and it should go in. And then you can make bracelets, necklaces, or anything. I actually like this bracelet because I could easily put it over my other one, and that's why I made it to this size. He's and then stuck. Usually it doesn't get stuck. I've been doing it all day. And then pull it off my wrist, and that's why I made it really tight so it doesn't fall off. And then I could just undo it anywhere, and I could use it as a fidget. But yeah, so that's what you could do with clothespins, and and it's actually kind of fun to just sit down with a bunch of clothespins and build something. Hey, okay. so yeah, there's just a couple things you could do, and hope you enjoyed. Hope you have fun with these creations. 
And see you later. Wait, not yet. Please leave a like and subscribe. Bye. See you later.